Hey what's up guys, IQ here and in this video we'll be counting down YouTubers behind the voices. But you guys gotta see the end to see what seems like Peyton from Ninja Kids playing in Elementals. It's just nuts! And remember to like and subscribe to get 24 hours of good luck. But anyways, in the first clip, we have David Dobrik, a super popular YouTuber with over 18 million subscribers who played in the movie Angry Birds. His role is quite short, but I think the part he had was an iconic part in the movie. He voiced the character Axel, and you might even remember this exact moment in the movie. Drop a like if you sub to David Dobrik though. Oh, it's on! Wow. Try, 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 try. Oh, it's on! <laughs> Next up, we have Daisy Ridley, the actress famous for playing Rey in Star Wars, and not many people knew she also played in Peter Rabbit. You guys gotta see this for yourselves, and comment below if you like Star Wars. Wink. I didn't even know we could do that. I just looked for the buttons, but then one time, it was your nipple. Oh! Should we break both ankles or just one? I'm sorry. In this clip, we have Selena Gomez voicing a character named Mavis in the movie Hotel Transylvania. Most people know her from her singing, but not many people know that she has 33 million subscribers on YouTube, and even less knew that she played one of the main characters of this film. Drop a like if you're a fan of Selena, though. Dad, but we don't even know if the kid's gonna be a vampire. I'd be thrilled if the baby's human just like Johnny. Dennis said his first word! Holy rabies! This looks like a blast! Hi guys! This is so exciting! Oh, look at all of this! So cool! Wow, I can't believe I'm actually here! Johnny! Dennis is not a monster! Next up, we have one of the biggest YouTube stars ever, PewDiePie, who's actually in South Park. So, if you don't know what South Park is, it's a cartoon comedy show, but one of PewDiePie's gaming moments was actually edited into the show, and it's so funny. A big moment for all the gaming YouTubers to be on TV, but watch till the end. Uh, There's not the bullet, and I gotta run! Run for the bunker! Run! Hi! We can go play the game downstairs! Isn't that better than watching some guy on YouTube playing it? Alright, I hope that's enough. Meh. <laughs> you see? Look at this! Ike has all his friends over, and they're just sitting around on their own computers, barely talking to each other. Ike is watching PewDiePie play Dragon Age. I'm going. Dun, 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 dun. PewDiePie! And this kid is watching Carmen commenting on people commenting on Dragon Age. It's a really great game. The characters are so rich. Better than Zeta. In this clip, we have one of the biggest musicians, Rihanna, hidden in the movie Home. I had no idea she was in this movie, and I don't think many people knew this either. But drop a like if you like her music, though. Knock, knock. The interrupting cow. Boo! <laughs> Well, you did not the no! interrupting cat. Okay, you did it again. See? Oh, that is. Next up, we have a Disney movie that actually cast YouTubers to play some voices in the film. The movie is called The Lion Guard, which is a spin off for the movie The Lion King, and YouTubers Dan and Phil actually played the part of the two gorilla princes in the film. Drop a like if you ever heard about this movie, though. Who are you? And what are you doing in the Pride Lands? <laughs> <laughs> ah, well, that's easy. I'm Majinuni, and this is my brother, Hafifu. We're looking for someone called King Zimba. He's a lion? I think they mean Simba. Yes! In this one, we have the baby from Boss Baby, and not many people know that Alec Baldwin played him. This movie was so funny. Comment if you watched it. Bruce? Astronauts and NASCAR drivers, that's who. You obviously didn't go to business school. The numbers just don't add up. Stay out of my way, or there's going to be cutbacks. Let's just say I'm the boss. Put that cookie down. Cookies are for closers. <laughs> Power nap! Next, we have popular YouTuber KSI, a YouTuber with over 25 million subscribers playing in an actual movie. So many of you probably know who he is, but may not know that he played in a movie called Late in America, where he was a main character. This is just nuts. One night, one mission. Yeah, that's right. Um, um. KSI. Duncan. Tabitha. In this clip, we have Anthony Padilla, one of the guys from Smosh, and he plays a role in the popular movie Angry Birds. 
He played as the green bird named Hao, and he does a fantastic job doing the voice. You guys gotta see his reaction when he got the role, though. I think you guys would be perfect for the roles of Bubbles and Hal in the new Angry Birds movie coming out in May. What do you think? Can we just have a quick moment to discuss, please? Of course. Oh my god, yes! Oh yes! Oh, my god. oh, this guy looks good. He's gonna make it. Oh, I'm right now. Nope, hey, he's coming back. But duck, get down. Uh, dude. Next up, we have Keanu Reeves, famous for playing as John Wick, who also has a role in the popular movie Toy Story 4. Not many people actually knew that he was in the movie, but he plays the part of Duke Kaboom, and you guys gotta hear his voice acting. It fits so well for the character. Jumped 40 school buses and landed back into my life. Hi, Duke. Who's the cowboy? Duke meet Woody. What do you mean? Duke Kaboom, Canada's greatest stuntman. Huh. Oh yeah. Ha. Huh. Ha. Huh. Yes. Huh? Uh... Hold on. One more. Oh. In this clip, we have extremely popular YouTuber Jojo Siwa, who has over 12 million subscribers, and she got to play a main role in the Angry Birds movie. The part she gets is the little blue bird, and the voice fits so well. You guys gotta see her do it, but drop a like if you watch Jojo Siwa. I agreed to do a voice. Mommy, did you get my picture? Did you get it, Mom? She's got so much energy and has this little raspy voice, and I think it just makes her pop. <laughs> mm, I got it! Whoa! I was just so happy because I've never done a feature film before, so what? better way to jump into the feature film world than the most adorable and awesome. In the next clip, we have one of the most famous TikTokers doing a voice in a movie you wouldn't expect. This famous person is Charlie D'Amelo, and she plays the smart mouse in Star Dog and Turbo Cat. The voice fits so well because she's supposed to be shy and timid, but you guys gotta listen to this for yourselves. We've got access to a tactical operations goldfish. I said, we've still got all the broken gadgets and robot parts they threw out of the museum. Plus, we've got access to a tactical operations goldfish. Oh, yeah. I hope young kids watch this movie and learn the importance of teamwork and working together. In our final clip, we have Mr. Beast, and I guess some fans found a clip of him in the recording studio and put Spider-Man right next to him. This definitely fooled more than a few people, and it makes it look like Mr. Beast played as Spider-Man, but I don't think it's real. But imagine if Mr. Beast actually did do the voice of Spider-Man? Drop a like of you to prove of this. Here, we actually have a clip where Peyton seems to be playing a part in the movie Elemental. I guess a fan found a clip of her in the recording studio and put her right next to Ember so it seems like she's playing the part. But it turns out the actual clip was her recording a song. Imagine if she played Ember Lumen though. I definitely want that to happen. If you made it this far, you're awesome. Like the video and subscribe and click on one of the other videos on the right. See you guys.